uh, if one eye is looking this way and the other eye is looking this way, the eye that's misaligned is going to have abnormal vision input to the brain and that's going to cause brain atrophy that's connected to that particular eye. And that whole process is called the lazy eye or amblyopia. The treatment for the lazy eye and strabismus, it's actually pretty straightforward. We have to penalize the eye that's that's working and we have to make the eye that's not working or the lazy eye work harder. So for example, if the left eye is straight and the right eye is misaligned, then what we do is that we simply patch the good eye so the patient is for or the child is forced to use the weaker eye. Or instead of patching, we sometimes we use eye drops or gel and we would put it into good eye and the function of those eye drops or the gel is to blur the vision of the good eye so that the weaker eye has to work harder. So that's one type of uh, treatment. Another type of treatment is that uh, sometimes we prescribe glasses. So glasses are prescribed for various reasons but one of the many reasons why the glasses are prescribed is to correct the misalignment of the eyes or to correct the blur vision. And the third form of treatment is surgery. So that's the last resort. So we try all the medical non-invasive procedures first and if those things do not work then we would have to go in and do surgery to correct the problem.